welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be sharing one of the best pdf editor that i found with tons of options and cover almost anything to do with a pdf like you can create a pdf sign a pdf extract the data create any kind of form pass it protect it and use many kind of ai options so you will be getting the link of this website that is pdf.wondershare.com you need to come to this website and here you can read about it like what exactly they provide you with all the detail you can check out here and you can download this for your windows pc laptop for the mac ios and for the android devices so click on free download and the file will be quickly downloaded now you have to go with the basic installation steps and once it will be installed you will be getting this kind of dashboard now here to in order to start editing your pdf first you need to click on open pdf or you can also drag a pdf file over here so select the pdf click on open and once the pdf has been selected you will find lot of options on the top menu option on the left hand side and even on the right hand side you will be getting the ai sidebar that is a kind of ai tool where you can chat with the pdf in order to summarize it or if you have any query then you can enter over here all right so we will have a look here one by one so in the home section you can minimize you can maximize it then you have the highlight option where you can also use the shortcut key that is alt shift and the one key so what you have to do click on the highlight button choose the color whichever you want to choose like i will go with this one only then i will select the part of the text that i want to highlight and you can see that the part has been highlighted with a yellow color you can change the color if you want to then on the right of it you will find the shape option and you can draw any kind of shape like rectangle arrow or any kind of line so let's say if i want to draw any arrow i will select it so i will simply draw a shape here and you can see the arrow has been created now if you want to change the color of this arrow from the right hand side you can change the color or if you want to make any changes then you can do it from here only and then you have the edit all so if you click on edit all and click on all then you would be able to edit any part of this pdf so let's see if you only want to edit any kind of text so you can click on text now here if you want to rename anything like if you want to change any part change any text you can do that if you want to add some extra text you can also do that by typing here so very easily you can edit your pdf here and also if you want to edit any kind of image then you have to select image then select the image here and then from here you can reshape it or you can replace with any other kind of picture and many other options that you get then you get the add text option ocr crop if you want to crop any part then you can do that then you have an amazing tool that is ai tool and if you click on it you get summarize pdf proofread pdf pdf ai written detect translate pdf pdf to markdown now part of this you can also access this ai tool by selecting any part of the pdf so let's say if i select this part at the moment i select it you will find a small box is popping up and from here also from the ai section i can access any of the ai tool so if i want to summarize it i can simply click on summarize and it will start analyzing it and then it will show you the abstract and if you want to reload it then you can do that from here and so again if you select the same part and go to the ai section you can click on explain you can go with the proofread now if you want to rewrite this then you can also click on rewrite and this will be rewriting this particular text particular paragraph in case if you are not comfortable and you need something new and here you can see that it has created very quickly and rewrite this paragraph that you selected then you also have many other options like you can translate it so i selected here the language hindi but if you want to translate to any other language like japanese italian persian portuguese russian whichever language you want to select you can simply click on it and within few seconds only it will be translating your particular paragraph or text that you want to translate and now let's move to the next section that is the edit now here also you can add the text 
you can add any kind of image if you want to add any kind of link let's say if i want to add a link here click on add link select the part where you want to add the link now here it says open a web page or open a file if you want to attach any kind of file then you can do that if you want that it should open on any uh, website so for example i just type here www.youtube.com now this can be any url name that you want to insert and then you can click on apply now this will be the clickable link and once you click on it and click on yes it will redirect you to that particular website or page then you have the watermark option so if you want to create any kind of watermark then click on add watermark now then from the left hand side it will ask you you want to add any kind of text or if you have any kind of file then you can also add it as a watermark so if you have any kind of logo then you can click on the file section and you can choose the path from here now for example i will write anything here like crown and you can see the watermark has been added here now you can also customize it like you can choose a different font if you want to reduce the size then you can also do it from here if you want to change the position then you can also do that then you can also adjust the opacity that seems to be perfect in front of text or behind the text you can also do that and so there are many other options and once you click on apply so now you can see the watermark has been properly added next you have the background option so let's see if you want to change the entire background of this pdf document instead of a plain paper then you can choose from the template here you will be getting some kind of template you can go with a green color or this yellow color if you want to add any kind of picture then you can click on add background click on file choose the file from here and then you can add it then you have the header and footer if you want to add or edit the header and footer then you can do it from here all right now next you have the comment section from here also you can add many kind of comment and you get many other options like you can search the comment you can add the comment you can edit it then you have the convert option very amazing tool and if you want to convert this pdf document to any word to excel to ppt to image to text then you can do it from here only with one single click so let's see if i want to convert this to a word document i will click to word click on save then i have to give the file name if you want to change it and then click on ok then you have to choose the output folder so click on it specify the folder and then i can save the destination now this time if i click on ok so it will take few seconds only and this pdf will be converted into a word document that i can view by just clicking on open folder and here you can see it has been saved in a word document bingo okay and then you have the view section from here you can just change the view section you can make it ai read mode you can rotate the view then you have the organize and from here you can organize your document you can split it you can crop it you can rotate it many other options that you can check here next we have the tool option where you get the ocr the combine the compare option if you want to compress it then you can do that if you want to make a batch pdf then you can do that next we have the form if you want to add any kind of form here so for example if i scroll down to the bottom and here if i want to add any kind of form like the list box then i can click on it and then i can choose where exactly i want to place it and you can see the list box form will be added here and once you have created now you can edit it do any kind of changes however you want to customize it not only this one you have many other options you can go with the checkbox you can go with any kind of radio button drop down or even any kind of image field and you also get the extract data option so if you want to extract something then you can also do it from here and now you have the product option from where you can add any kind of password so here you get encrypt option and if i click on it it asks me to open the password so it gives you some kind of options here like to open it need a password yes i want this then i have to enter the password and once you are done you can also choose the encryption level and click on save 
and similarly you get many other options like you can sign a document so simply click on sign document then you have to place the box where exactly you want to sign then you can add your information you can click on new id then it asks you select an existing digital id from a file so if you have any existing digital id on your device only then you can select from here or if you want to create a new digital id you can select this option you can click on next choose the format click on next fill all the information and then you would be able to successfully create the signature here you can also request for the e-sign here all right guys so once you're finally done and if you want to share this document this pdf then you can do it from here click on share now it will be creating the link here and you can share it you can view the mobile uh, preview you can create a scan code so that anybody can scan it and view your pdf document you can also email it and if you want to download then you can click on this download option and the file will be downloaded and now if i talk about the pricing you get many free option in the free version but still to enjoy all the option you can click on pricing and here you will find all kind of detail like the quarterly plan is around for $14.99 this is the yearly plan this is the perpetual plan so you can check out from here only so that's all guys for today and hopefully you enjoyed this video found this pdf editor one of the best editor that i found as well and if you have such kind of uses for the pdf then surely go ahead download this the link will be in the description and if you like the video guys make sure that you hit the like subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye